today we are going to learn C. C is a basic programming language. C is a high level language. First, uh, let me tell you what is the use of C. Why we need to learn C? C is a general purpose high level language that was originally developed by Dennis Ritchie to develop Unix operating system. This is the history of C, where C is used. So why people uh, will opt C? C is easy to learn, C is structured language, it produces efficient programs and it handles low level activities. So before going to learn C, uh, we need to learn any programming language before going to learn that we need to know what is that, what is the use of that, why we need to learn. In, uh, in learning C, you can learn other high level languages like Java, C++, something and uh, first you need to know the use. The uses are here, I will tell you, the uses of C. So, uh, C is international user for system development work. C is as fast as the assembly level programming languages. Uh, every high level language will be converted into low level instructions that is not even the assembly level language. So the assembly language instructions are the, are the things which are executed by the CPU, actually executed by the CPU. So C is as fast as that. So C is used in uh, creating operating systems, language compilers, assemblers, text editors, print spoolers, network drivers, modern programs, databases, language interpreters, utilities and so on. If you go and surf through the web, there are many things to know about C. C is the topmost place and very efficient in embedded systems, in, in desktop systems also. It is very fast compared to other languages. So uh, this is what about the overview of C. Then we need to set up our environment uh, to implement C programs. So basically C is implemented in Windows and in, and in Unix. So in Windows we are going to use code blocks, IDE, integration development environment, integrated development environment. So next in Unix I am executing directly it will be there. So we need to install code blocks IDE and we need to install Unix. In Windows Unix is uh, uh, implemented using virtual blocks using virtual box so we need to install the virtual box software and after that we need to install the Kali Linux I am using Kali Linux here because it have inbuilt C and Java so code blocks uh, see how to install the code blocks so please keep practicing